Welcome back, family. With the MTV gun from selling Kobe, we picked up Ruby Dwayne Wade and on next Jerry Lucas. Dwayne Wade is coming off the bench and Lucas is going to be our stretch four. And here is the fantastic bench. We got Brook Lopez, Dirk in the front court. And in the wing, Manu is injured so we bumped up Luo Dang. Pavlicek is at the two guard so they will surround Wade with good wing defenders. Hopefully D Wade can get to work. And yes, Jeff Teague is finally starting for the Fantastics. We got Paul George and Carmelo Anthony as our major scorers. Jerry Lucas is our stretch for and designated defender. Anthony Davis is going to anchor the back line. And yes, family, let's welcome Jerry Lucas. Oh my god, look at those sideburns. The sideburns. Well, let's begin by looking at some defense. And we're in the white jerseys. So I'm suggesting that you should switch to the big, play contain on the penetration, and then go back to the Roman. This is perfectly shut down by my Anthony Davis. That is great pick and roll defense, family. And in the following clip, you can see the Sam Van play chain in action. So we're chaining the 1-5 uh, angle down here. So this guy was really good, so I was very excited. You can see him playing great on-ball defense, so it doesn't get him with the initial play. We swing the ball around, and go ahead and out of play. We chain it into a tri-top 1-4 fist. Once again, he's playing great on-ball defense, but back-to-back -back plays is too hard to defend. Oh my god, Paul George, what did you do? What did you do? Here you can see him playing great defense again, but we're gonna move the ball around. And family, Jerry Lucas is not kidding around with his shooting ability. Look at him stick this free here. Bang, 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 bang. So you can see here, I'm trying to get him with one of my favorite plays, and he plays great help defense. Look at that, he just get out of here, Sam Fam. And he also is a great off the ball cutter. Look at that backline cut. And by this point, he is killing me. He's up by 6 and have only scored 11 points in almost a half. And with that, Eric Spostra is pissed off. I mean look at him, he's so angry his eyes are about to run into each other. And of course, who steps up? Jeff Teat always responds for the Fantastics. Thirty-eight, thirty-five. we finally have the lead, family. And the following is a Sam Fam tip of the day. So today I'm going to show you guys another play that is awesome in this GSW playbook. And it's called Sipper Fist Down. So you can see it here, I'm setting up with Teague. And what's going to happen is Mello is going to use that screen set by Jerry Lucas. And he's going to loop back up to the top. So you can see, Lucas sets the screen, Mello loops up. But at this point, you actually have two options. You can go to Mello up top. Or you can go to the post up with Jerry Lucas. So this is great play. Now we go to Mellow here. There's no free, but automatically another screen comes in. Great continuation. Two points, family. And yes, this guy's good. So by this point, it was a two-point game with four minutes left. The Sam Fam's gonna go to work. Look at that side pass. Mmm, Mellow for the free ball. Yes. 47-42. Here we go. Now at this point, this is just good defense. I'm gonna get him with a double, surprise him a little. And rotate myself with Jeff Teague, see? He forced the pass, we get the ball back. Good defense always leads to easy offense. And we're going to keep the ball in Mr. Teague's hands. He got us here and he's going to finish it for us. Oh, is that Paul George? Oh, that is a switch ball. Let's go, Paul. Woo! Man, this is a gold Paul George with like five gold badges. Can you imagine when I get the snap on one? Now, in the next clip, here's some NBA 2K honor, family. For some reason, he glitched out and he got a five seconds violation, so I gave him the ball right back. Rio recognizes Rio. This guy played a jits. So I'm gonna give him the benefit of the doubt. And like man, we battled. This is a one-on-one -on -one situation. Paul Judge was Chris Paul. He crossed me up. I came back and he still hits it in my face. Seriously, I love this guy. Symbol for the win. With the game winding down, three-point game. Sam Fam is not messing around. Jeff T gets in there. And one more free ball for Mr. PG13. Six-point game. We just need one basket. 
So Jeff Teak is gonna get it to us. Come on, Jeff. Good defense. Gonna work the ball around. This guy was amazing. Great sim defense. So we're gonna get him on a pick and roll. Jeff Teak is on fire. Look at Jeff Teak, guys. Left, right, in and out. Oh, another one. Bangity, bang, 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 family. And Jeff Teak gave us the victory. After that basket, it was just too many points with him, so it turned into a free throw contest. Jeff Teak put it on ice. Seriously, I should really start it. I mean, I should keep him as a starter. I keep trying to replace Jeff Teak, family. I'm so sorry. He has led the Fantastics to so many victories. So anyways, 59-51. Shout out to whoever this guy is. He was he was legit. Best game I ever played on RKT Team Fest Ball. So, props to him. The winner's gotta win. So Fantastic is moving on. And if you haven't seen the last episode, you can click the link there. I faced this guy's amazing Gary Payton, Jordan, Onyx, Pierce, Pink Diamond, Malone, and Sapphire Yao Team. 